Johnny Ramirez lives just across the street from the family and knows them, but he was not prepared for what happened early Friday morning. Somebody started knocking in the door, and when I got out, it was a lady with her face um, full of blood. At that moment, we called the, the police. And we tried to help her as, as, as best as we could, and um, we found out a little later everything that happened in there. Orange County Sheriff's investigators say the victims and the shooter all lived together inside a home off Myers Drive in Orlando. Sheriff John Mina said 23-year-old Chevelle Jones and his girlfriend got into an argument Thursday night, and he began gathering his stuff to leave. But Mina says Jones came back with a gun, killing her and three of her family members. He murdered uh, the 49-year-old matriarch of the family, um, her two daughters, uh, 28 and 29-year-old, the 29-year-old is Jones' girlfriend, and tragically, uh, he also killed the matriarch's four-year-old granddaughter. Any death is, is terrible, but a, a young child is just magnified. Detectives say two other children, the four-year-old's twin sister and a six-year-old, hid when they heard the gunshots. The sheriff says Jones also shot his girlfriend's other sister. She was the one who ran to her neighbor's house for help. The, the family and their loved ones, you know, um, prayers to them, and I hope that they get justice. Deputies found the suspect alive with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Chevelle Jones underwent surgery. The sheriff says if he survives, he will be charged with the murders. We don't have no problems. They, they've, been, they've been coming up and down the street for years now. So it's, it's, it's kind of hard for us to believe what happened. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.